channel my name is Ege and this is a new vlog this is a bookstore vlog so I was in Lagos I think yeah it was last week and I was in Lagos for like three days or so anyway, but like I was in Lagos and I was just like since I'm in Lagos let me go and do some content related specific YouTube shabo content related activity so I went to a bookstore the name of the bookstore is Roving Heights it has two branches in Lagos and I went to the mainland branch because it's the one close to where I stayed. Anyway, so I went to the bookstore and I think this is my very first time in a bookstore. I, okay, technically I have been to a bookstore, but the bookstores in Vinny City, I can't really classify them as bookstore bookstores because these bookstores are more of, they sell academic books and then they just have fiction and things I would generally enjoy shoved in a box somewhere at the back of the store so this was like the first time like the, my very the first time that i was at a bookstore dedicated to the type of books i like so i was really excited and i and i got a lot of clips i filmed a lot of things what am i saying i was really excited i was really happy so i got some books and i didn't actually get a lot of books because I'm starting to learn self-control because I saw a lot of books as I wanted but apparently I'm becoming more responsible with money because I only got four books actually I only bought two books that day I got four books but two out of the four I already bought so I went to pick them up and then the rental I bought at the store but anyway I have started learning self-control guys please Help me thank God for my life because it was a struggle. I saw so many books that I wanted to get, like books that the covers were just so pretty, and I was just itching to throw all my money away. But I survived out of the thing. But I really had a good time. I had a really good time at the bookstore. The the staffs they were really nice, and ooh, I also met another bookstagrammer. She's her name is Sheila from the Sheila the book one. If you are from my side of bookstagram, which means if you like, if you are an African bookstagrammer, Instagrammer, like you are on your or you are familiar with Nigerian bookstagrammers, then you may know her. Her name is Sheila the Bookworm. She likes her, um, people know her for her violence. Like the young lady, she's not afraid to, if she doesn't like a book, she's not afraid to let you know that she doesn't like a book. Like she, people know her because for her violence. Anyway. Go, ask, um, go follow her on Instagram or Instagram or whatever. I met her and it was really nice meeting her. She's really, really nice person in real life. And just like, it was really nice. And we talked a bit about certain books. We talked about um, the Poppy War and other things like that. It was really fun. I really enjoyed it. And also, the staffs were also really friendly. I actually wish I got a clip because there was one time where one of the people that they were recommending. He recommended Love in Color to me because I took honey and spice. It was really nice. I had a really good time. I survived. So anyway, without wasting too much of your time, I'm just going to leave you to enjoy the vlog and then at the end of it to come back here for a book or a for the book haul. <laughs>
them high Anxiety is showing underneath my eyes Watching as I let you take up all my time Just to do it over again Drag me through the dirt, degrade me Mess things up and always blame me Smile politely while you tear me down I don't wanna be a yes man Pulled up bluff and wanna shoot my whole hand Sick of saying sorry cause I can't stand To lose myself to your ego But I can never say no Push and pull, now I think I'm getting seasick Say what you mean and put your money where your mouth is Giving the run around, thinking I'm gonna Drown head up of water, but I'm going down. You're so used to getting the things you want. Burn down your bridges, no matter the cost. Put on a poker face, trying to play the game like you're the king and I'm your pawn. So now we're just going to quickly go into the book haul because I didn't get a lot of books. I have a lot of books here, only like four books to talk about. So this is not going to take too much time. I'm going to talk about the two books that I already bought but just went to pick up from the bookstore. And the first book is The Final Empire Miss Born. Miss Bond, the final empire. Sorry. Anyway, this is the first book in the trilogy, and I already had I previously got the third and second and third book, but the first book was not available. So when the first book became available, I quickly purchased it online, and now I have the three books in my collection. Then the next book I got was Honey and Spice. I actually initially wanted to get akata warrior which is the second book in the akata witch series but that was not available so i just decided to pick honey and spice which i actually read recently and loved like this book took me by surprise this is like i didn't expect to like this book at all this is just one of those books where you're like um like when it came out people were talking about it some people liked it some people didn't like it i, I just felt like i would like the book and then one day I was just like, oh, let me read it. Let me just dip my, <laughs> put myself in this place since I was, I had nothing else to do. And I listened to the audiobook and loved it. I always try, whenever I, I've made a promise to myself that whenever I, I talk about this book, I'm going to mention the narrator of the audiobook, which is, her name is Weruchi no, Opia. Like, we need to give her her coins because she did a fantastic job with the audio book it was spot on i loved it i enjoyed it more because of her narration so i just said whenever I'm going, i was going to talk about honey and spice i was going to mention the narrator because like she finished work with the audio book she did like she did really well i really enjoyed it anyway so the other books that i got that i bought at the bookstore so the first book i got was book lovers by emily henry and Guys, I'm currently in the middle of this book. I'm enjoying it. Okay, not really middle, but like I'm hundred a hundred chapters. I'm at chapter ten basically, and I'm really enjoying it. And I started this book before I got to the bookstore, and I was reading the ebook, and then I got to the bookstore. I saw a copy, and I was just like, since you already enjoyed the book, at least you know you won't hate it. So I got myself a physical copy. 
And then the final book I got was People Pressing. This was actually recommended to me by Sheila, you know, the person I said I met at the bookstore, the other bookstore grandma that works there. Yes. Sheila recommended this to me because I was just like, oh, let me ask for her opinion for one book. And she said, oh, get this one that she's quietly reading it. And the audacity of men in it is shocking her. That was like, I'm, I feel like I'm paraphrasing her, but that was something around what she said. I'm going to read it hopefully soon, like soon, like within two weeks of posting this video, I should have finished this book by then. Yeah, anyway, people person, I literally don't know what it's about, but the author of this book is Candy Ca Candy Scotty Williams. Williams, yes. And she's the author of Queenie and everybody that has read Queenie says it's messy but people enjoy it i have not read queenie but i'm picking up people person because it was recommended to me and if i like this one enough then i'll probably go and read queenie but i'm expecting messy characters i'm expect I'm, i said expecting i'm expecting the men in this book to irritate the life out of me yeah we'll see how it goes for this one okay so that is all for this somehow is this can this be considered a vlog bookstore vlog that's all for this bookstore vlog guys thank you so much for watching with me up to this point if you've reached this point of the video <laughs> if you got up to this point with me let me know if there's any of the books that i talked about that you've read or uh going to read that you're really excited about or if you did not like at all and feel like i just wasted my money let me know in the comments i will see you in my next video don't forget to like comment subscribe everything all the good stuff i'll see you next later guys next time guys wow i don't know english today bye